can you wild camp on access land? Many people enjoy camping in the great outdoors, and there are plenty of scenic spots to choose from. However, if you're not familiar with the area, or you don't have a lot of experience camping, it can be tricky to find a place to set up camp. In some cases, you may even need to seek out permission from landowners before pitching your tent. But what about access land? Can you wild camp on access land? Here's what you need to know. Is wild camping legal in the USA? While it is illegal in most areas, wild camping is legal in national grasslands and forests throughout the US. Although it is not legal everywhere, North America has been tolerant of authentic camping. The only real limitations are that you may be required to obtain a permit and adhere to conditions that are laid out by the Park Service. Wild camping is legal in 154 national forests and 20 national grasslands, encompassing 191 million acres. Although there are strict rules in every country, the general rule of thumb is to stay away from avalanche areas. Avalanche areas are areas where trees and plants are scarce or non-existent. While camping in such areas is entirely legal, it is often suicidal. Always keep your eyes open for animal tracks. It is also advisable to stay away from areas where fires may occur. This way, you will be less likely to get burned or injured. What are the rules on wild camping? Wild camping is legal in Scotland, England, and Wales, but you must seek permission from the landowner before pitching your tent. Landowners are often more than happy to let you wild camp as long as you respect their property, behave well, and take rubbish home with you. There are several different types of wild camping zones. Some areas are privately owned, such as state or federal land. Others are protected areas, such as national parks. There are some countries where wild camping is allowed on government land, but it is illegal in other areas. Some countries prohibit wild camping on private property, such as on a nature reserve. Some other nations prohibit it altogether. Generally, you can only find wild camping areas in these countries if you hire a guide. Is it possible for wild campers to stay in car parks or other non-natural areas? It is not possible to camp in car parks or any other non-natural areas because they are not designated for camping. The only exception would be if the person was given permission by the owner of the land. Thank you for watching. I hope you liked the video. Comment your thoughts down below and subscribe to the channel for more camping tips and tricks.